Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're going to jump right into this. This is from my last video. So if you've seen it, you know that my base was a moisturizer, a liquid highlight, and a little bit of foundation. So that's what I have on underneath, underneath this concealer. Um, I'm just blending it in now. But I did my eyebrows off camera. And um, the eyeshadow I put on is just... A little bit of browns in my crease I use like three different browns from a BH cosmetics palette and I just blended it all into my crease I'm doing a pop of color today so I decided that I wanted it to be red and you'll see what I do but right now I'm just blending in this concealer as good as I can making it as seamless as possible and now I'm going to take my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder and bake a little tiny bit. Maybe for like uh, less than a minute. <laughs> Too Faced Contour Kit. I'm taking both of the contour shades and chiseling my cheekbones just a tad bit. I like to go around my jawline. It just chisels those as well. <laughs> and then I take the excess that's on the brush and I use the lightest contour shade to go over the translucent powder under my eyes so it's not so white. And then I take the same brush and I find that contour on my nose like this is so much better. So I take the darkest shade in the palette and I chisel my nose as well. So now I'm going to make a line underneath where I contour it just to sharpen it. So this is what the powder does. It just sharpens your contour that you already did if you got it a little bit messy. Now I'm going to blend that off immediately. And you don't just want to wipe it off one time. You want to make sure you blend all of that contour and the powder together so it won't be a harsh line and you won't look white and ashy underneath your contour. That's the BH Cosmetics palette I use for my eyes and now I'm just going to take like a dark brick red and put it under my waterline. And I'm intensifying it so it can be my pop of color. Now I'm taking a transition shade that I had already used before and I'm just blending that into my crease again to blend all the colors together. Now I'm taking my Becca Champagne Pop and I'm highlighting just a little bit. I want this look to be pretty matte because I'm going to be wearing red lipstick and I just like a matte look with it. So I'm spraying with my Urban Decay Setting Spray and it was going crazy all over the place but I always blend with my Beauty Blender after I set with the spray. It makes everything look super flawless. Now I'm going to take Sin from MAC. It's a matte lipstick and I'm going to line my lips with it. And now on my lips I'm going to take Ruby Red. Something like that. Ruby Woo. <laughs> Ruby Woo. <laughs> and put that on my lips. Wow, I haven't used MAC lipsticks in a long time. And that is it. Thank you guys for watching. Come back. Love you.